Hey, <laughs> this is so funny. When you're trying to do something um, that is really supposed to be a benefit and uh, try to make things work, you can only do the best that you can. And um, so just bear with me. Um, this is a uh, motivational moment with Coach Dana. I am Coach Dana. <laughs> And um, please uh, forgive me. This is this is I always use my resources. Whatever my resources are, I always use them. And um, I always seem to um, it's it's always something when I um how can I say worry about people and what people say or what people are going to think. But this is this is. This is real life, you know, when you are a person who is a home business owner and you do ministry from home or whatever from home or on the road or on the move or whatever, this is what I do. This is Coach Dana. That's all I can say. I am um, really excited. I just want to share with you, um, I just want to share with you basically the motivation I have for today. And I'm, I'm really loving my new style. <laughs> I am a person who wants to encourage everybody. I want to build everybody. I want to see everybody succeed and um, go further in life than, than where they are currently. And when I think about where I am or what I do or, or why I'm in the place that I'm in, there's a reason why I'm here. And if I can just encourage you to um, know that where you are right now is okay to be there. Just don't stay there, especially if you feel like you're stagnating or your gifts are not being used. Just realize why you're in that particular place. Um, everyone knows I left the 9 to 5 in December, and now that I've left the 9 to 5 and I'm doing ministry full time and businesses are, I guess, coming up on the back end, I understand um, part of my purpose, and that is to help people and to build them. Now, I may not be like... Um, the Oprah Winfrey's or the uh, Tyrese Gibson's or I, I may not be like people that are closely related to me that are, are entrepreneurs, uh, business owners, um, music moguls. I may not be like them, but I am Dana. I am Coach Dana. I am Apostle Dana. I am um, the the founder of Bad, Blessed, Anointed, and Destined. I am that person. So when you think about where you are, Know that you are that person. You are in a place of being because you're where you're supposed to be. You are who you are. And um, it doesn't matter what people say or people think or, or how you should be. You know, there's no booklet for this. You know, I, I was at a coffee meeting, I guess you could say, um, today. And I thought, wait. There's some things I know I should have done by now, and those are probably things that would have opened doors for other things, and I haven't finished them. One particular is um, some books I was supposed to have written by now, and when I got back to the office, in my home office, when I got back, I looked into all of the things that I knew I was supposed to write. I looked at all the books that I have written thus far since 2011, and I'm not very far off my um, numerical deadline. I won't tell you what that is, but my numerical deadline. I'm not too far off. So I need to just look at what I have started that I haven't finished. And I know that those things will be a part of um, what I should have had done. And then I'll just wait on the next set of instructions. Um, one of my ministry friends said to me today, just do, the, just do it one at a time. When you know that you've missed something or you haven't finished something, just go back figure out what that is and and finish those things one at a time. Now that doesn't mean, you know, me. Y'all know me. I'm the jack one of all trades and I am master of all. It may not be in the level that some of you might be thinking, but hey, I am being successful. People know my name. Uh, people know who I am. And, and, and right now that's where I need or want to be. But those things that have gone undone, okay, I can't do five things at once. So, of the undone things. So, I have to do one at a time and make sure that they get done. And make sure that the Lord has, you know, directed me in those things. So, my motivational moment for you today is, one, don't worry about people. Okay? One, don't worry about people. Two, do it the best way that you can with all the resources that you have. 
Three, if you miss something and you know you need to get it done, get it done. Because those doors that were supposed to be open for you years ago will start to become open to you. Doors, windows, your cup is going to start to overflow. Four, get your napkin ready because the Lord is about to set that table up for you. And you know what? Five, understand that your gift makes room for you and puts you before great men. God bless. I'm Coach Dana.